MLS News, Tata Martino has reportedly been hired as Inter Miami's new head coach. According to a report by Fox Sports, Martino will step into the role left vacant after Miami fired Phil Neville. Martino led Atlanta United to an MLS Cup title in 2018 and previously coached Messi at FC Barcelona and then as head coach of Argentina. Martino most recently coached Mexico at last year's World Cup. Nico, Mr. Miami, what do you think about Tata and Messi teaming up for the third time? It's not a bad shout and uh, in Inter Miami, I think it would make the most sense mm -hmm. for Tata Martino to go there. It's, uh, if you want an Argentine coaching Messi, someone from the same city coaching Messi, uh, they were together right now at uh, Maxi Rodriguez's send-off game in Rosario. So you have an experienced manager at the national team, knows how to handle Messi, knows how to handle the dressing room with Messi, and not only that, has already won mm -hmm. MLS mm -hmm. Cup. Yeah. I, th I think, not that it's a no-brainer, but it makes, makes so sense. much sense. And the only reason why I say no-brainer is because I think his legacy has a small taint from his time in Mexico where it really went so wrong. Why, why you didn't like the word taint? A small taint? <laughs> <laughs> please continue. <laughs> what did I say? Just I, stop. Uh, Just no, please no, continue. No, no, no. It's gonna be I hear nothing here. I see. Exactly. Uh, <laughs> you looked at right there. It's your fault. <laughs> it's your fault. It's your fault. I'm usually the one that catches these things. It's yeah, I know. Like, nope, <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna try to be serious Thank now. You. Yes. Um, yeah, and his you time in Mexico. Said small was, stain, you, by you, the way. <laughs> Jeez. You could have yeah. said small stain. That's your fault. What did I say? Okay. <laughs> anyway, you were, yeah. uh, uh, his, his Mexican national team experience was not good, but mm. bouncing back with Messi is gonna be a good option. I think the. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> it's also a smart hire. I think the. I think. The fact mm. that he does have so much MLS experience and has won an MLS Cup, what he did with that Atlanta United team was was remarkable, absolutely remarkable. Um, and I think that that for that reason alone, um, this makes so much sense. But the he's connections, have a lot of influence, he's have also. so much influence. But he knows this league, and he's he's gone on record as saying like he kind of, it's like he. He wanted back in. It's like MLS is the league. Like he can't yeah. quit. He wanted. He wanted to get back in there. And, and so I think it, there's motivation on on both sides. And I think one player that I'm excited to see how that relationship rekindles, Josef Martinez. Ooh. Can he get oh him gosh. back to the goal scoring feet? Didn't even. This is why it's a smart. Josef Martinez. Regardless of the fact that it's Messi's friend, you know what I mean? Oh. It's actually a smart wow. hire. He's won MLS Cup. He I, understands the rules. Joseph Martinez is there. Yeah. It's a smart I, hire. I don't, I don't necessarily know if he's Messi's friend. Mm. Why did he get hired by Barca? That, that's, that's the first part of the relationship. He wanted, Messi wanted Tata Martino at Barca because they had the Rosario connection. But after that, they, they don't have neither a positive nor a negative relationship. It's a professional relationship. More out of respect. After, respect. after the national team, M Messi, Messi isn't out there throwing flowers constantly at, at Tata Martino. It was a professional relationship. You don't especially think Messi after... was reached out to and said, hey, we're thinking of hiring oh, Tata Martino? Oh, for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that would be a, a, a great and option. And he okayed it. Yeah, but yeah. I, I don't think it was a bad relationship, but I don't think it's a flower re relationship. They don't that doesn't need to be. Right. It's yeah. a professional relationship, yeah. and that's yeah. it. I think it's, it's not like, yeah, I, don't, I don't think he's, me I think you would be incorrect in saying he's Messi's friend, as if, like, mm. would Messi you say probably he's installed not Messi's him friend. at Barcelona. Would you say no. he's not Messi's friend? No. So then we could say he is his friend. Uh, and, I think, <laughs> and I think it's smart <laughs> for his career, because he was in between <laughs> two very difficult places in his career. You know, it's, you know, it's kind of funny, too. How much is this going to piss off Atlanta United fans? Oh, oh my oh. God. Because they are an ornery bunch. That's now, yeah. that's now a rivalry. Yeah. I know it was yeah. them in Orlando. This yep. is now yeah. a football. Yeah. Already salty. Yep. Oh, I kind of love it.